hey everyone, how's it going? So, uh, how far are you guys with your Omega Mon? Have you managed to get into 4 star yet? In my case, I barely, I really, I just got into 4 stars like a few days ago. And his battle power right now is 150,000, which I don't really have strong, uh, oh, what am I doing? Strong matrix on him. I put my strong matrix on uh, World Greymon instead. Which you can see here are like plus 100. And Omega Mon is a bit weaker. So if I were to put Matrix on Omega Mon, his battle power is going to go to uh, 60, 160 or 170,000, right? So what is your current battle power of Omega Mon right now? Alright, alright, now let's check him in battle. And also, I've noticed that a lot of you have gone for his defeat mode skin. So, let's go into battle right now. The best thing what I like about Omega Mon is that um, his ultimate skill reduces fury, even though he doesn't even have awakened weapon yet. Which is like, how should I say, for Draymond's awakened weapon reduces fury. But in this case, Omega Mon is even better, even without. Awakened weapon, like look at this. And you can see your fury down. Yep, fury down there. And his pure recovery is when an um, enemy or ally dies, which is still pretty cool. So let's see his ultimate skill again, in slow motion. Fury down. And the next best thing what I like about him is his normal skill, he actually attacks in vertical row and he has stuns. Well, in most cases he does stun the enemy, but not in this time. And my computer is going very slow right now for some reason. So let's go back out of this. So go into Omega Mon, and I'm gonna try and awaken. Who should I awaken? Should I awaken his. Which I already have awakened here. Or should I do Siege Ramon? Hmm, this is interesting. Let's see the battle power different because Siege Ramon has 130k, and Mega 150. Well, definitely gonna be on Mega Mon, guys. It's either your main team or secondary team, and main team is always, you know, always first. That's why it's called main team. Now we're gonna. Hmm. Let's awaken once. Once here as well. And here too. And the rest. Let's go with the uh, beat drum on. And that's it for now, <laughs> until I get another, uh, what is this, 10, 12, 13 more um, Awaken Alloys. Alright, so let's go into battle one more time. Now you can see that his fury he already starts up with almost half there, right? Same as XB Mon. And if you notice that his fury is also recovered faster than XB Mon because of two enemy died already. And oh well, stunned, but somehow I didn't kill him. Hmm. 
Now, I'm gonna use ultimate skill, and after these three enemy Digimon dies, hopefully he would have full fury as well. Hopefully, let's just try it out. So I, I haven't really tried Omega on my team so far. Okay, maybe not. I really wasn't hoping to defeat him, but okay. Defensive block right <laughs> over. Yeah, you can notice like his, his attack is really low right now though. I mean he is at 4 stars, so don't expect anything strong attacks. When when you get Omega Mod to 5 stars, then the effects like you'll notice a difference. Alright, I'm gonna leave it at that. Let's go back. So yeah, thanks for watching everyone. Uh, if you have any questions, leave it down below. Regarding your Omegamon, your fusions, or I think... I can't remember, I think next week or next month, maybe, is, I think is the Omegamon Awakened Weapon. Oh no, sorry, uh, no, 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 not Omegamon Awakened Weapon, it's um, Alphamon Awakened Weapon. In the next Diamond event. Yeah, if you see here, my attack for Alphamon is so low. And then Agnimon. Okay, uh, see you next time, everyone, and take care.